and ready. Well, welcome to, for those of you who hadn't been in here before. This is the governor's office, and it's uh, in this uh, very historic state house. And uh, it's a good place to be doing what we're doing today because this is historic as well. Uh, we are, I'll be signing into law in a moment the Persons with Disabilities Right to Parent Act, which is a actually is a codification of best practices concerning various rights of families. It's important that we have strong families. Families are the building block of the strength of people, and people make a state, and state make countries, and a strong country makes a strong world. And what we are intending to do in South Carolina without limitation is to keep our families as strong as possible, because that's where our strength comes from. So there, there are people here who've, who've worked on this, the ideas and policies behind this new law, and I'm happy to recognize some of them now. And the, the leaders would be first be Representative James Smith, and then Senator Katrina Sheely, and she will also introduce them. Thank you, Governor, yes, very much. Nice to see you. Yes, Smith. yes. Good to be here this afternoon. This is a very, very special uh, day. And Governor, thank you uh, for uh, uh, convening this and for us all to share in this wonderful day uh, and this moment, momentous occasion of you, with your signature on this important piece of legislation. But I was very grateful to be a small part of this. There were so many people involved in getting this bill, this uh, important measure uh, established into law. And first, the bipartisan support that was built. It needs to be, although it took us a couple of years and there were some bumps in the road, right? Uh, uh, but success and victory was ours. And it was done ultimately by unanimous votes in the House and unanimous vote in the Senate. And that couldn't have done with, been done without my help of, help of uh, Senator Sheely. And thank you for your help in guiding it through the Senate. Uh, also, Abe Alessi and uh, Kimberly, your, uh, Ms. Tisso, your inspiring leadership getting it done. And uh, really, we just wouldn't, wouldn't have happened without your efforts. And we all know that. And we're all very, very grateful for that. Uh, Gloria and perfect protection and advocacy, your work was instrumental in, in helping us get the right language. And in, and in the end, DSS, uh, 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 Ms. Wingo, your support and effort uh, at a critical moment, uh, seeing the vision of what we're trying to do, which is simply that uh, uh, by virtue of an individual's disability, it should do not ever deny them the right to parent their own children. A simple idea, important concept of value that we all share as South Carolinian that has made the law by this act today and by the governor's signature, and thank you for that. Um, Senator Sheely, thank you for your help, and love to share the podium with you. Well, I, I can only repeat what Representative Smith said first. Uh, Governor McMaster, thank you for giving us the opportunity to be here today and sign this important piece of legislation into law. And uh, thank you, Representative Smith, for your part in, in getting it through the House. You know, we worked several years trying to get it through the House, the Senate, and it took a lot of work on behalf of a lot of people. I've enjoyed working with Kimberly, and we're going to keep working together to work for the rights of the disabled because there are so many things that we need to continue to do. But this was very important. And um, like I said, I could just repeat everything he said, but I won't do that. I won't belabor this important um, issue that we're fixing to do. But I'm going to uh, hand the mic over to Kimberly and let her say a few words, because I know that's the most important thing today, to let her say what's on her mind. And yes. um, so we're going to do that right now. Well, thank you. Um, this is just an absolute celebration today of the passing of the, the Persons with Disabilities Right to Parent Act. We have been at this for a little while. <laughs> um, I promised I would not do this today, but um, this, this law means so much for South Carolinians with disabilities. We have, we've, for so many years, have not had this right to be able to parent our, our children, to be able to be a foster parent, or to be able to adopt. And this just is critical that South Carolina is now showing this support for South Carolinians with disabilities to show that we are able to be just like any other citizen in South Carolina. Um, this legislation is, is landmark for our, for our state, but 
as our, for our country as well. There's states that have been contacting us and are actually modeling this piece of legislation for their state. Um, and, and this is big for South Carolina because South Carolina has not always been at the top for disability rights. Um, but together, we are going to change that in South Carolina. Um, I want to also just thank some of our, uh, obviously, Representative James Smith and Katrina Sheely, Senator Katrina Sheely, you guys have been rock stars in all of this. Um, Governor McMaster, thank you so much for signing this. Um, this is just critical to show your support that South Carolinians with disabilities do deserve equality. So thank you so much. Um, our And our uh, very important partners, Protection and Advocacy for People with Disabilities, South Carolina Department of Social Services, South Carolina Developmental Disabilities Councils, the parents that have come forth to share their stories with us and to also provide testimony. We could not have done this without them. So today is a great day for South Carolinians with disabilities. Hey. signing if everyone will just look at the bill. And don't be distracted. I've got nine people <laughs> to use them all. <laughs> just a funny way to sign your name. All different pens. There you go. That's it. There it is, Lord.